hello guys and welcome to my channel oh my god don't even mind me right now um i literally just got to my uh hotel room i'm already in tijuana getting ready for my surgery i'm literally like just stressing out i'm thinking the worst that's gonna happen um i don't know i'm really i have really bad anxiety you guys i don't even know i just you know i want to go back home to my babies i don't know I'm just thinking the worst like I'm thinking that something bad is gonna happen but the more negative I think the more bad I feel so I'm trying to just think positive you know wake up get ready to go I mean I'm already ready I'm staying at um, um, a hotel like that's literally right across my my the clinic but yeah I mean I already have everything packed as you can see there, I just literally have to shower. Um, I'm gonna go to sleep really early today because I have to be there at seven. So, yeah. Um, but so far, Tijuana is really nice. I like it. It's not, I thought it was gonna be like scary because I hear like scary stories about Tijuana. But honestly, I really like it. It's not that bad. But yeah, <sighs> you know what sucks, guys? I freaking started my period. So it's going to be difficult for me to be like using the restroom like post off, but we're going to see how that goes. Um, for those of you who probably don't know yet, I'm staying at Cocoon Recovery Home. Oh my God, I look so bad, you guys. This is crazy. But yes, I'm staying at Cocoon, um, but I will keep you guys updated. Tomorrow when I get there, I will be filming so I can show you guys what it looks like. Um, but yeah, so right now I'm just going to get ready, um, shower actually. My bag's already packed, I'm just kind of going to organize it. And not that nothing's going to happen to me, but just in case. Jesus, I don't know. This is probably not even going to go out. <laughs> but hey, if it doesn't go out and whoever goes through my camera, post this video. <laughs> but yeah, I'll keep you guys updated. Hello guys. Oh my god, my face is on each other. I can't. I don't want to show you guys. I'm just kidding. But I just woke up. I showered. I'm just double checking my bag. Everything is there. I forgot my robe, guys. So I'm hoping they have some so I can buy some. But I mean, they're probably going to be fucking expensive because, you know, I'm not sure. But you guys pray for me. I'm like, you guys are going to watch this video after. But hopefully all goes well. My mom's here being my support system. Um, I miss my man. My man had to stay with my girls and well his mom too, but Hopefully all goes well. I'll keep you guys updated when I get there. I'll, I'll film so you guys can see what it looks like But yeah, I'll see you guys in a bit Okay guys, I'm here already. Oh my god, it's getting real guys. I don't know if I'm gonna do it. I don't think I'm gonna do it, guys. I'm, I'm just too scared. I'm getting really bad anxiety. But I'll keep you guys updated. Hopefully, I turn out the way I want. But they're running some blood work, so hopefully everything comes back good. Because if not, I'm gonna have to reschedule. But hopefully not, right? And I'm whispering because I don't want to hear me because it's quiet in here. Okay guys, oh my god, it's getting real. They want me to put this fucking cuz on her. This little thong, but I'm on my period, so I'm gonna tell them I don't want to put it on. <laughs> hey guys, I just got up from surgery. I feel like shit. Um I still feel so drowsy from my face, I feel like well my face is always fat, you know. But I feel like it's very inchada. I don't know if it's just me, but I can't even hold my camera, so I'm gonna make this work. Um, I went into surgery around 10:30 a.m. or 11, and I got out at 3:30 or 4. I remember, I don't remember nothing. Like they put me to sleep and knocked out. I just remember 
um, being like waking up in here. But when I woke up, oh my god, I was just so thankful. Like I just, I was wanting to wake up. I didn't want to like not wake up, you know. Especially when you have kids, you think bad, but. The doctor was so like sweet. I would recommend him a thousand percent. He was just such a sweetheart. Um, all the staff made me feel comfortable. So full, yeah. So far since the time I've been here. And I'm gonna take a fat ass nap, guys. <laughs> I'm so tired. I'll keep you guys updated though. Bye. And this is my day one so far. Hey guys, it's the next day. Um, yesterday I had my surgery. Today's Monday, the 14th of June. Yesterday I had my surgery on the 13th of June. Um, I had it around 10, 30, 11. I got out of surgery at 3.30 to 4. Um, I knocked out until this morning. I had to get up to shower. It hurt so bad to get up. Oh my God. I just, it was so painful. Like, the way I'm sitting right now, you can see it. I'm so inchada de la cara. My fingers look, they're really fat right now. I gotta take a picture of my food, it looks so good, hold up. The pain to get up to shower is so bad, you guys. Like, I was shaking, literally. And they made me go here, I'll show you guys, huh? I couldn't have asked for a better surgeon, honestly. Like, Dr. Cabrera was amazing. Like, he was so kind, genuine. Like, he really does care for his patients, you know? I feel like he's the one, like, the staff here are really nice. They made me feel comfortable. But once I talked to him, I just, like, had all the confidence. Because honestly, I was, like, thinking of backing out. I was like, I don't think I can do this. Like, it's, it's not worth me risking my life. And after I talked to him, like he was like, don't worry, you're in good hands with me. You know, you're going to be okay. And he reassured me that everything was going to be fine. So I'm thankful for that. Um, I would recommend him to anyone, 1,000%, honestly. Um, and then, oh my God, I wanted to cry so bad. Because I looked at my body this morning and it's just so beautiful. But... I will keep you guys updated. Um, I'm going right now, like I think in two hours, I'm going to the recovery home because right now I'm still at Lotus because they had to keep me here overnight. So I will keep you guys updated once I get there. Um, but yeah, I'm okay. Right now I'm not feeling any pain. The only pain I felt was whenever I had to get up to shower. But I'm on meds for pain, obviously, so I'm okay. Hey guys, oh my god. It's so bad, but I'm gonna be embarrassed if the nurses come in. But dude, my face is so hinchada right now. This is my day one of recovery. Um, it's really hard to get up. It's painful to even use the restroom. Um, it's so painful. I can't even describe the pain. Like I really can't even get up. I need help. Well, obviously, you know. But um, I have to stay in this position all day. Oh, it even hurts to, for my arms to move because I'm pretty like bruised up. But um, I mean, if I'm laying down, it doesn't hurt too bad. It's just like when I get up and I have to, because I have to go pee and it sucks because I'm on my period, you know what I mean? But um, I'm not waiting for the third day because I heard it's really bad. But I'm just trying to rest as much as I can, take my pain meds. So hopefully I feel better, I don't know, tomorrow. But I know they say that their day is a bitch, so. Yep, I'm just trying to get through it. Because I get so desperate, like, when I feel a certain type of way. Like, I was getting anxiety earlier, to be honest. Because I was just like, I don't know why the fuck I have this sticker on my finger with the book. But dude, I'm so happy because this lady... She comes in to do my eyelashes if I want to get my nails done, my toes, like a pedicure. So I'm probably going to get my lashes done. 
just because I could feel pretty because I look like shit as you can see but yeah um right now I'm just resting I am in a lot of pain if I get up I have to go pee right now but fuck I'm just thinking about it um but it's good they have tv here I'm staying at Cocoon Recovery Home amazing service honestly I love it here they gave me breakfast lunch and dinner oh my god I'm so bruised up I'm over here having like a breakdown because I miss my family. Oh my god. I'm getting homesick or something. But I miss my girl so much. It's hard. But today's my second day. Well, basically my third day because I got surgery on Monday. Hello, guys. Today is my third day. Um. Look at how bruised I am. Oh my god. Yesterday I was trying to film, but I had like the worst anxiety, so I did not. Um, I was crying so much. I miss my family. I miss my man. I miss my daughters. I miss my mom. My in laws. Um, but I miss my girls so much. Like, I cried so much yesterday. So I didn't really want to film, but. I feel like yesterday was so far the hardest day I've had. Like, I could not get up for nothing. No. Honestly, the first day was really hard. But yesterday was just as hard as the first. Today I'm on my third day. It's better. But the only thing that hurts is my back. Like, I get up so I have to be at Coachella. Because it fucking hurts really bad. They just brought me my... Breakfast. Is it breakfast? I thought I ate already. But yeah. I don't know what it is. But I'm hungry. And it's like I got surgery on Monday. It's Thursday. I haven't even pooped yet. And I'm getting desesperada because I don't take this long to poop. So I know I have to because it hurts my stomach. But. I get embarrassed when they come in because they're going to see me filming and shit. <laughs> but what's it called? The incision does not hurt. Like, I don't feel that at all. It's just where they did lipo, like on my sides and my back. Um, and right here. Oh my god. Look. I have a strias. Oh. But guys, my butt is so humongous right now because I'm in Chala. But so far, so good. Um, I'm just really homesick right now. I want to go home. It's early Thursday. I'm going home on Sunday. I have I got my first massage yesterday. It wasn't painful. It's just the back part. But I got scared because I was draining a lot. And I got this, like, Mariala because... Um, I thought I was going to faint. But I'm good right now. I'll keep you guys updated day by day. Um, I'm really in chala for my face too. As you guys can see, my lips are... I don't know. I look like shit though. Hello guys. This, the nurse just braided my hair so I look a little funny. But it's cute though, look. But anyways, I'm just eating right now. This is my food. And then my pills. But today is day Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Day three, but kind of four because I got my surgery on Monday. But I feel good. I got my massage today. I feel way better. Um, I just don't like, like, I have to depend on the nurses right now because I can't do shit for myself. And I don't like that. But I feel good, to be honest. It's just like the painful part is like when I have to get up, go pee or shower, that shit hurts. And I'm on day four and I haven't pooped yet and it's like really getting me desperate. Like I'm getting anxiety because I haven't pooped. But no, honestly, recovery, the first two days, it was so bad. And then like I'm getting homesick too, but today I feel good. I don't feel that bad. But yeah, I can't wait to show you guys my results. I already took pictures. Um, I think it's worth the pain, but I won't come back for round two like I said I was. 
too painful. But I'm coming back in December for my boobs a thousand percent. But I don't think it'll be as bad. Because I got my tummy tuck, that shit hurts. But I love my results, you guys. It's like my body looks so good, Jonah. And the, the fucking food here is bomb as shit. It's, it's jugo natural. Bomb. Mm, that's bomb. But here at Cocoon Recovery Home, dude, like, I call the nurses every hour. They're amazing. Amazing. I recommend 100%. Um, every single, like, nurse here, they're so nice to me. Oh, my God, I want to cry. I've already fucking picked at it, but this is what I'm having for dinner. It's like nopal con bistec y arroz. But anyways, guys, today is my... What day is it? Today's Friday. My surgery was on Monday. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. My fourth day. Well, fifth including surgery day. But it's because a lot of people here don't include surgery day, but I do. So it's fifth day for me. But what was I gonna say? Um, oh my God, you can't see me like that. My bruises are bad. But anyways, every day gets better. Honestly, today is so much better. I can get up off the bed by myself. I don't need help, but I do need help going to the restroom because I can't like bend over as much because I'm wearing a diaper. Like, cause I'm on my period too, and I leak from the back on my drain, so I have to wear one. But, but yeah guys, I feel better today. Um, it's not as painful as it was, but for sure I still do need help doing things. So yeah, my recovery is going good. I, I was, I mean, the first two days were really bad to be honest. But every day that goes by, I feel way better. But it's just a pain that I can't explain. Like, you guys have to just go through it because I can't explain it. Like, you're numb from your areas that the doctor did lipo. Oh, shit. Hold up, guys. Hey. Hi, mama. Hi, goo. I just finished my food really quick because they had to take the plate, but... Um... I'm getting so homesick, you guys. That you guys don't even understand. Like, I miss my family. I miss my man. I miss my daughters. Well, my, when I say family, I refer to my man and my daughters. But I miss my mom too. Oh my god! It's because I'm not used to being away from them, and I cry and I cry. But hopefully, I'm trying to see if I can go home tomorrow. Tomorrow Saturday. I mean, yeah, tomorrow Saturday. I'm trying to see if I can go home tomorrow. Because I can't do this no more. I am not used to this shit. I feel lonely. I'm just literally on this bed. Like all day. All day. All day. I don't do shit but stay on this bed. Or like I go to the restroom and eat. I go to the restroom and sleep. That's all I do. So I just want to go home. But so far, my toughest days were day one and two. I'm fine now. Obviously, it does still hurt. Like, my back is numb, but it still hurts. I don't know how to explain to you guys that. But, yeah. Let me try to figure out the situation because I'm trying to go home tomorrow. But yeah, I'll get back to you guys. Look, I can stand up already. They're gonna read my fucking food so I don't want them to see me recording. But look, I can walk good now. <laughs> Hold on. Watch, guys. I'm pretty snatched, but I'm swollen. I'm such a fucking idiot. So yeah, I can walk. I've been walking like this for like two days. But it still hurts to get up because I have a lot of liquid in my bag. I 
can't do nothing with my ass yet. But I feel good today. Saturday. My shit. What's that? Oh my god, guys. Oh my god, did you miss me? Ay, te miras bien quemado. ¿En la cámara o así? Hey guys, I am exactly one week today post up. I'm with my babies. Look it. Look it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> She's I hold up, but I'm not ready. But I am feeling good today, honestly. I feel better than I did obviously a week ago. Um still painful. It's not painful. It's cause yesterday no, I didn't feel Okay, I did. Um, you know, I have mixed emotions on how I feel. It hurts, sometimes it doesn't, I'm fine. But um, like right now though, I'm laying down with my boppy pillow, my booty. I still have my drain in. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling great, amazing. I have my mom's help this week. Also, when my honey gets out of work, then he takes care of me, he takes over. So like he showers me, helps me go to the restroom. <laughs> um, he literally wipes my ass, literal, literally, literal way. Give me it. Give me it. Here, she's gonna take over. Hold on. So hey guys. Hi guys. Welcome to my channel. Welcome to my channel. To my channel. <laughs> Look at my baby. No baby. Oh, my baby. Let me see. Cheese. Cheese. So guys, today I'm obviously, I already said it, a week post-op. Um, I'm gonna post a video from when the day of surgery, I think it was the day before until now, and I'm just gonna upload what I have, and then I'll post another one one month post-op, and then just um, how it goes. Like, you know, um, right now, it's, I just can't do much. So I'm gonna try to edit this video and get it out there for you guys, but um, yeah, that was my first week of surgery and this is how I'm doing so far. So I'll keep you guys updated. <laughs>